Dear Sasha, I have the noob. He is a kidnapped. I'm holding him for ransoms. More on that in a minute. First, I will continue with my diabolical note. I kidnapped the noob while he was sleeping and transported him to my lair in the comic book dimension. Don't try to follow me. Only I know how to get there. And only I know how to get back. I want a billion dollars. Or your comic friend will never return. The only thing that can bring him back is the sound of at least 50 toilets. But really, what are the odds that will happen? How ridiculous. It's weird to me, frankly, that the sound of 50 toilets flushing, not at the same time necessarily, mind you, is the only flaw in my plane. But what are the chances? So I figure it's worth it. Okay, money or no noob? Sincerely, Diabolical Dina. That's terrible that the noob was kidnapped to the comic book dimension. Wait a second. What's this happening? Somewhere. I don't know where I am. I'm supposed to be doing a show now. I'm pretty scared. I can talk. Yikes, I hear somebody coming. Well, that looks like that must be Diabolical Dina. Who was that? Thinks the noob in a whisper. Don't know who the heck that was. I think she lives here. Wherever that is, I miss all my bodies. Sasha, Army, David, Bill, that guy who keeps calling me, my noob. It's nice to be able to talk, though. Dot, dot, dot. What's next for the noob? That's terrible that he's in the comic book dimension, but fortunately, our special guest tonight happens to know a lot about the comic book dimension. So, come join me now, Professor Hop Chump. Hello, Sasha. Hello there, Hop Chump. How are you? I'm fine, it's good to oh, it's meet good you. It's good to meet you, too. Hello, Hop Chump. My name is Professor Hop Chump. <laughs> it's wonderful. And I am an expert. I have a college <laughs> degree in dimensional studies. That's wonderful because yes. my friend the noob is in the comic book dimension. Oh, he has joined a terrible realm. He is, he is in the comic book dimension. There is little hope for your friend. Maybe we should have a telephone call, Hop I Chump. think that would probably help tremendously. He Hello there, caller. Canoe is not too sad. He's around a bunch of bootylicious women, and he can see a lot of coin slot action, you know what I mean? I don't know who Canoe is. Maybe you do. <laughs> I don't know who Canoe is. Uh, there's a galaxy called the Canoe Strain, I believe, but uh, I don't know if it has his other dimensions. I'm an expert in dimensions. Well, Professor Hop Chump, you're very intelligent. Uh, thank you. I do have multiple advanced degrees in the study of dimensions. Many. I, I won't list them now. I... I well, okay, I will. I have a doctorate in dimensional relations. My beard is intrusive. It's very collegiate. Thank you very much. Hello there, telephone caller. Hey, how do you get a beard like that? How, how do you get a beard like this? Yeah. Uh, it takes, first of all, uh, my young friend, hitting puberty. <laughs> and then you grow okay. up. What? Okay, Doki. It sounds like you had reverse puberty. You had accidental reverse puberty. That was a dimension. What that, a terrible dimension. They saw reverse awful. puberty dimension. Hello, the telephone caller. Hi, I was topic starter for all the callers. What's that? Um, how do you feel about Perry Shelton going to jail? Okay, well, that's a good topic. Maybe for the hop chump. Uh, well, 
For Paris Hilton, going to jail would be like entering another dimension for this woman. I mean, she's used to parties and drinks and the cocaine. Suddenly, she would be in jail by herself, reading a book. And I heard we have a picture of Paris Hilton getting ready for jail. Okay, hello there, telephone Goodness. caller. Hello, Sasha and Professor Hop Chomp. Hello, caller. How, how are you doing? I just wanted to say how much I enjoyed that comic. It's a terrible thing that the noob is trapped in there, but I enjoyed him giving me props and also David. You know, it's good to see finally people stop hating on David. That's well, right. Noob is very friendly. Uh, it's hard for him to hate many people. Uh, What's your, where's your first name, Professor Hopchomp? Pro professor. <laughs> okay. Professor, professor Hopchomp. I guess I didn't hear you right the first time. He's no, no, it's <laughs> Professor. That's, I was saying my title the first time. Now I just told you my first oh, name. Oh, so professor. professor. Professor Hopchomp. Correct. Okay. Well, uh, I hope the noob comes back. Unfortunately, I'm not near a bathroom. It doesn't so, look like he will. Bill, uh, you know, since you're not, maybe you can help us find the Joey. Oh, I'd love to find the Joey. Let's go uh, the third one over. These there you go. Up, you oh, that's not Joey. That's Abraham Lincoln. That's Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Very <laughs> close, Bill. Very close. I'll try again. No, maybe later. Okay, Bill. Talk to you later, buddy. Hello there, caller. But Bill likes to play games. Hey, Professor, yeah. I'd like to know what dimension do I fall under? What category? What dimension you fall under, David? I presume this is David? Yes, this is David. Representing Sci-Town. David, you are in the funk dimension. I'm in what dimension? The funk dimension. The funk dimension. Funk Are you David. watching a different show? David, who's that lady in there with you? That's my sister. Dale, tell your sister we say hello. They said hello, Karen. <laughs> hey, David, will you come on the show next week? I'll come on the show two weeks from today because that falls under my birthday. Do you promise you will be here for your birthday two weeks from today? I'll, I'll try to make it. No try, David. What would the Yoda say? I'll be 31 that day. That's great. You're going to be here in two weeks. We'll see you, David. Hello there, caller. Hello. Hello, buddy. What's up? What's up, Sasha? This is Kenny from South Carolina. Buddy, it's good to hear you. Did Hello. you hear about the noob? No, I haven't, I haven't been watching. I just moved into a new house. I don't have the internet yet. Well, he's trapped in the comic book dimension, but we have ah. Professor Hop Chump is here with us. Hello, Kenny from South Carolina Dimension. How are you? I'm great, man. I just got a $64 tip off a big table, waiting table. They Whoa. By the way, we haven't heard from you in a long time, Kenny. How's it been yeah. in South Carolina? It's been all right, man. It's getting warm out here. Do you know we were, coming. we were in South Carolina? Whoa, really? For the, the Charleston Comedy Festival a while ago. Sweet. Yeah, but we, we didn't get a hold of you. Nah, I mean, I'm kind of hard to get a hold of, I guess. This, this is the only way we can get a hold of you is through TV. Yep. Is but, there any games going on? Can we get the new out of the comic book? No, but you can help us find the Joey. So which one of these bloated kangaroos many pouches do you wish to look in? Uh, what are my choices? Maybe uh, I can't see There's it. five of them. Just pick a number and I'll, I'll pick one for you. Five. Uh, okay, we'll count backwards. Oh, looks like you <coughs> found the kangaroo's secret butter. Man, you know it's under number five. Give it to me. Uh, anyway, the line's crazy because it's from South Carolina. Uh, I can't hear the static. It's too staticky. <laughs> That's right. Hello there, color. <coughs> okay, that's the beep person. Hello there, I telephone like caller. Hello? Hello there. Hi. Can I flush the toilet for the noob? Uh, go for it, buddy. Will it help? Well, we need 50... Well, Professor Hopchamp, you explain. Well, it will help. It will get you one fiftieth of the way there to rescuing the noob. Okay, 49 more to go. And, and according to dimensional theory, he will be re rescued. That's great. So we have one of 49 toilet flushes. 49 more to rescue the poor noob. Professor Hopchamp, what would we do without you today? I'm. It's just a lucky coincidence that I was here today. Hey, sure is. Hello there, caller. Sasha, I have a clue from a very famous television person that may help find the noob. Who's that? What's that? Quick, tell me. Get off. Soapy, you know, soap, I've gone all over me. 
and then my grandfather would take this hose and go like this with me, squirt all over me and fill me up to you. They sounds like Mr. Rogers. <laughs> What do you think about that clue, Hop Chump? I think it uh, it leads us down a dark, dark path. Okay, that's fair enough. Hello, the telephone caller. Professor Hop Chump, you know all about different dimensions, right? It's true. Have you ever reached the uh, climax dimension? I will hold off on commenting on the climax dimension as its ramifications are inappropriate for public television. That's right, caller. Shame on you. Hello, the telephone caller. I want to do my part for the new, but I have two bathrooms, so here's one. 48, Martin. Now I got to run through the house. Okay, I'm entering the second bathroom. Two bathrooms are pretty close together, caller. This is Bill, buddy, right? That's me. Okay, Bill, you helped the noob a little bit. Hello there, caller. 47 more to go. Hey, Fossil. David. I want to play a game. That's great, buddy. Find the Joey. Can we find Paris Hilton? <laughs> yes, David, find Paris Hilton, but it, she's somewhere in the kangaroo, the bloated chubby kangaroo that we have. Go, go for the third one. This one right here. What? Behind Ab Abraham Lincoln. What's this, David? What did you find? I don't know, is that a noob in orbit? No, that's a little army bird. David, will you come to the show two weeks from today? I'm sorry. I, uh, there's no guarantee. I gotta work around my work schedule. David, On check your birthday. Check me out, buddy. <laughs> that's what we will if you're here, David. I promise you, we'll have bikini ladies as well. Bring Hello. the punk. That's right. Hello there, caller. Hey, it's Governor Kevin. Governor and I'm on a diplomatic mission to the toilet dimension. So right now I'm in a room with these 45 toilets. So if I, and I can flush them. So I can maybe help through the new, but there's only 45 and not all 47. So... I'll do what I can. Oh no, the phone broke. What right? happened? No, he was about to save the noob. Oh, that's too, that's bad. too bad. I think he's like probably oh. cross-dimensionally maybe. Yeah, the phones. I, that's correct. It, it, that, it is a disconnect there between dimensional lines. That makes perfect sense. Uh, I think so. Home. Hello, the telephone caller. First, I'd like to give a shout out to David's sister, Karen. And uh, also, I want to tell David that if he shows up, I'm going to show up and bring him a nice birthday present. That is wonderful. Bill, let's give you another try. Find that Joey. Uh, underneath the secret butter, please. Okay, dokie. Oh, you found the duty. Duty. The duty flag. Duty's always under the secret butter. <laughs> That's where you weird. find it. <laughs> I always find that to be true. Okay, hello, the telephone caller. Hello. Hello. What can we do for you? Hey, can I find, uh, find the Joey? Find that Joey. Okay. I I want to pick the one that's underneath the um the the Abraham Lincoln. This one? Oh. I'm not looking at my TV. I don't know. The one that's under the Abraham Lincoln. Well, it looks like you found the tape measure that's also a snake. I, I hate oh. snakes. I hate hey, snakes. I just got cable. Is this what it's all like? This is pretty much all of cable, body. Uh, All right. Hey, do you want to say hello to Army? Yeah, hi, Army. <laughs> okay, it's good to hear from the new caller. Hello, the caller. If Dave won't show back, come. Hey, Kabubi, do you want to find the Joey? Oh, he hung up. Hello, oh, the caller. Hello. <laughs> I love that guy. This is pretty nice. What's up, yeah. dude? Nothing. I'm do, fine. Do you want to find the Joey? Sure. Where, which pouch do you want to look in now? The one up under Abraham Lincoln. You did it! You found the Joey! Yay! <laughs> hey Buddha, I'm on TV! This, you are on TV. What's your name, buddy? Javante. It's good to hear from you. Do you have a toilet to flush to help rescue Noob from the toilet land? From the yeah. comic book dimension? Yeah. Buddha, Buddha. Yes, I do. Buddha, Buddha. Hello? Hello there. Hello. Yeah, am I still on TV? You sure are, buddy. Okay, so what am I supposed to do now? Flush a toilet. Okay, hold on. 
Well, but hop chomp is something. It took too long. It took too long to flush the toilet. Uh, if you want to create a dimensional warp for the noob from the comic book dimension, you have to be expedient about flushing these toilets. I mean, Stays dimensional true. cross space time doesn't wait for anybody. You know, we have so many emails to read. First, oh, I have to, want to remind people to send us an email at email at talkingfunny.com. That's beautiful. Yeah, and uh, here we go. Really quick, I'm just going to skim them. This is from The Wolf. Uh, okay, he likes his some jokes. Uh, has guy has a jumper cables, and the bartender says, Don't start anything. Okay? And then uh, something about Mark Twain. That's great. The Wolf is good to hear from you. Here's an email from The Queen Bee. Who says that the show pretty much he says it's stinky and that we should not have television show. So uh, we don't like you then and you are a dummy. Do you want to say something to the Queen Bee? She's the Queen of Crap. That's right. And from Mr. Sloat. Oh, our oh, buddy heavens, Mr. Sloat. Mr. Sloat. That's right. This diabolical figure himself. Yeah, he says he saw the noob's father at Dixon. He's doing fine. Uh, he's going to be stopping by sometime pretty soon oh, to goodness. meet the guy who's dropping off an imported doll. Hmm. Uh, that's great. Well, maybe we'll see. That's right. Mr. Sloat is into collecting imported dolls. That's right. Yeah, has a collection. Has a collection of dolls. Why Perfectly would you? innocent. Hello, well, why, would you, why would you? Hey, was someone saying something about Buddha or something like that earlier? This the, he was. The guy before was. Oh really? Yeah, that yeah, was weird. Anyway, could I do something to help out the noob? Okay. That's wonderful, Governor okay. Kevin. Now we're at forty-six. Body. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, do you want to help us? Do you have a high school? Yeah, I do have a high school. Do, do you go to prom? Uh, no, I'm a junior. We don't have junior prom. Okay, but maybe uh, you can help dress this regular boy for prom. Okay, uh, let's give him a, uh, like a bow tie as big as his head. What do you think of this fella? What? What do you think of this fella? Uh, he's, uh, he looks pretty regular to me. I don't know. Uh, not much to <laughs> That's right, Kevin. He is. Uh, yeah, that's very distinguishing there. Okay, let's... Oh, man, that's one big bow tie. It sure is. Is your sister barking? Is she barking? <laughs> yeah, that's my sister barking. Your Kevin. sister's name is Barkin? <laughs> yeah. That's right. Bark. That's our name is Barkin. That's our Barkin. We have to go. They, he's, now he's in the dog dimension. Did he say that he named his sister? Is that what happened? They the parents didn't want the responsibility. You name your sister, Barkin. And then their son grew up to be governor, so... What a great you, family. Yeah, you don't know what is good parenting these days. Evidence. Hello there, caller. Hi, Sasha. Hi, Professor Chop Chop. No, Hop Chump. Hop Chump. <laughs> I'm uh, really worried that the noob is stuck in that aha video, so I was hoping I could help out a little bit. Okay, dokie. That's great. What's that okay, kind of That's down to 45. That's five flushes this show. We're never going to get this guy out of this dimension. Hey, what's your name, caller? Um, Jenny. Jenny, do you want to help dress this handsome regular boy for the prom? Yes, would you please give him sock garters? Of course we can. What do you think of this fella, by the way? Uh, pretty handsome. But not as handsome as Bob Charlish. Woo! Oh, that's right. Uh, Bob Charlish was pretty handsome. <laughs> but, uh, okay, bye. Bye, Jenny. It's good to hear from you. That sounds like Jenny Bob Churlish's wife. <laughs> hmm. but oh, that's why she said the thing about Bob Churlish being handsome. I'm going to give... I, I'm guessing. Uh, yeah. I'm going to give socks. She only said the garters, but what are sock garters without nice, handsome socks? Why would you wear them without socks? That's right. Hello that's there, caller. Hello. Hello there. Hello. Dress this regular boy. Awesome. Let's give him... Gloves. Give him what? Gloves. That's a good gloves. idea, caller. We're going to give him gloves on his nicely shaped hands and try to preserve the the beautiful hands that he has developed. He has lovely skin. That's you want to protect that. Very pretty. Okay. Hello there, caller. Let me hear you. It could be. It might be. It is. Oh, for the long one now. Hello there, it's Harry Carey. <laughs> Can you give him a cum's hat? He could be. He might be. That's the noob. I want to dress the regular guy with a cum's hat. Put a big C on it, because comedy is a river win one. I'm drunk, Sasha. <laughs> okay, buddy. Hey, Harry Carey, do you have a... a Oh, oh Harry Harry Carey. Carey. Oh, that was famous. He was a famous announcer. That's too bad. That was chunk. a great call. 
Oh, I love Harry Carey. It's very wonderful. A hell of their telephone color. Can I help dress the prom guy? Yes, you can, my body. Was well, I think he need a money belt, a big money belt, so he can get lots of money. He need Visa, uh, uh, American Express, uh, Master Charge. Then he'll look good to any girl. How's that? How's that right there? Yeah, have the uh, Visa and Master Charge. It's in out. there. It's in there. It's a money belt. It's inside. Okay, thank you for the call. Hello there, caller. Hi, I'd like to dress the guy. Of course, this regular Bella. What do you want to dress him with? I want to... Can you give him a ginormous dong? <laughs> <laughs> How do you mean? Like a, a doorbell? It probably means because he has to ring the bell to for the To get the, the girl. To get the girl. That's right. We'll give him a ginormous ding-dong button. On the door of He's the like house. reaching for it. That's what happened. Right? That's beautiful. That's right, because he's going to meet this pretty prom Very day. pretty girl. Okay, so, hop jump. Uh, how many toilet flushes do we need? Uh, we need 45 more to rescue the noob. I, uh, we've gotten through five, and the show is five minutes from being over. I don't think we're going to rescue the noob this week. I don't want to be pessimistic. I just have a feeling. Well, you know, it might take a little while to rescue him from the perhaps, current perhaps. Division. But we're down to 45 left, so... Hello there, caller. Hello. Hello there. Hi, a quadrilateral is given in space such that its edges are tangent to a sphere. Prove that all the points of tangency lie in one plane. Answer that, Professor. You know what? I think she's trying to get you to do her homework. Yeah, her. that sounds like a No, I don't have any homework. I'm graduating. <laughs> is this barking? Is this bark? <laughs> sounds I think like it's barking. <laughs> barking, the girl. Yes. Hello, I thought it was Stacy London from What Not to Wear. Oh. <laughs> it could also have been Barkin. You may be right. Barkin the girl dog. Hello there, caller. It's awesome, man. That dude needs the Luxus. He needs some women. Tenson and that, and that ride. David, one thing. If it was the Lexus or the women, I only have time to draw one of those. The women. Okay, and we'll see you in two weeks, David. Okay, so we're going to give a women's. So here's the little women's. And she has nice pretty hair. Oh, she's so pretty. But in we'll say times four. You know what, uh, Professor Hop Jump? I have a feeling when he rings the dong, the ding dong, and uh, the date's going to be sad to see her. They has a women. All these four women with him already. That's right. Well, they're tiny. Maybe they'll hide in the bushes. I, I can't. I'm let's the make them hide in the bushes. I never went to prom. I was destined to be a lonely professor my whole life. That's okay. We'll hide those women in the bushes. Hello, their color. Hello there, caller. Hello there, caller. Hello oh, there. Hello, hello there. Hello there. Hi, you can't answer the question, but I can. <laughs> okay, doggy, barking the dog. Hello there, caller. That was a How about a big 21 carat uh, blue diamond? 21 carats? That's going to take forever. Why would you take that to the prime? But whatever, I guess. I don't know. What is his name? Manoob? This character's name is the Manoob. That's right, it's the Manoobinator. Hello there, ah, caller. Manoobinator. Hi. Hello there. I'm Sasha. I'm Sasha. No, I'm Sasha. <laughs> no, I'm Sasha. <laughs> I'm Sasha M. We've played this game before. No. Yes. No. Okay, Doki. You know what? I can prove it. Hold okay. on. I have Sasha on my back too. But you can prove that. You sound like a girl and Sasha is a boy's name. No, it's a girl's name. No, it's a boy's name. Girls. Sasha is a girl. Sasha is not a girl. Hello there, caller. Hello, this is uh, Joey Lawrence. And uh, I just want to say that you can't use my photograph without the express written consent of Joey Lawrence. Okay, Hello. Okay. Joey Lawrence, let's dress this regular boy for prom. Uh, maybe put some polka dots on his boxers. Some what? Coconuts! On. Coconuts. Okay, we're going to put some coconuts. That is uh, a little coconut. risque. So they're almost like polka dots. You know? Yeah, like polka dots. <laughs> it's very nearly what it is like. Coconuts, polka dots. This boy looks oh, like he's ready to go to the prom. I'd say prom. so. He is a dapper dude. I hope he has a very hot evening. I bet he will. And here's his date. Woo! Woo! She's so pretty. She's very pretty. <laughs> very nice. Hop jump. Let's have another phone call. Hello, the caller. You know, new backwards is boom, and Sasha backwards is ass. Ah. Harry Carey, the noob's in the comic book dimension. 
Why would I ever want to do about that? Could you help me out? Flush I your toilet, Harry. Lost your toilet. Oh, hold on a second. We only have to very quickly. Get out of the toilet. I gotta flush it. Here we go. Oh, Harry. Get out. Get out. Hey, Harry. Hey, Harry. A Harry Carey toilet flushes with 10 regular flushes. That's wonderful. So what are we at now? 30. No. Yeah, 35. 35. We'll see you next week. <laughs> Ba la 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 la